Here's a poem that does something similar in English. This is a poem called The Negro Speaks of Rivers by Langston Hughes. Now, Langston Hughes wrote it when he was just out of high school. He's probably 17 or 18. And he was taking the train to Mexico City. His father lived in Mexico City, and it invited him to come and spend the summer there. And he had the letter that his father sent him. And the train went over the Mississippi River. And he saw that river, and he thought about all the things that that river had meant to his people, to black people, to African Americans in America. How terrible it could be to be sold down the river as a slave. Or what it meant to the history of the country when Abe Lincoln went down the river to New Orleans. And then he thought about other rivers that he had known or heard about. And he took that envelope and he wrote down a poem that goes like this. The Negro speaks of rivers. I've known rivers. I've known rivers ancient as the world and older than the flow of human blood and human brains. My soul has grown deep like the rivers. I bathed in the Euphrates when dawns were young. I built my hut near the Congo, and it lulled me to sleep. I looked upon the Nile and built the pyramids above it. I heard the singing of the Mississippi when Abe Lincoln went down to New Orleans, and I've seen its muddy bosom turn all golden in the sunset. I've known rivers, ancient, dusky rivers. My soul has grown deep like the rivers.